Okay, now here are five major reasons why you should consider buying or upgrading to a Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra from any device you currently have. The S23 Ultra comes with an all new Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chipset made specifically for this device, which offers a marginally higher clock speed to boost the performance. This chip has an increased primary clock speed from 3.2 GHz to 3.3 GHz and an increased GPU clock speed from 680 MHz to 719 MHz. Samsung claims that this chip is powerful in terms of performance when compared to the regular Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 you get on any other phones. And at the same time, this is also power efficient which does improve the battery performance, helping the S23 Ultra last longer than the previous Gen S22 Ultra. This seems to be great balance of performance and energy consumption on this device. However, we will know how good this is when we test this device. As soon as I get this device, I will test the battery performance and share the real life battery test results with you guys so stay tuned for that video and be sure to subscribe to the channel as well now reason number two is this huge upgrade in the camera department this time Samsung's focus was completely on the camera's low light performance and video quality these cameras offer super HDR for capturing wider range of light and dark tones in the videos and for more accurate colors the cameras can capture with 12-bit dynamic range as well for the first time we are getting better 4k 60 FPS super HDR for both rear and front cameras 8K at 60 FPS with wide angle view. The cameras can absorb 2.5 times more light for brighter video footages. We are getting a 200 megapixel camera with adaptive tetra squared pixel sensor. When the lighting is low, 16 pixel combine into a larger pixel to capture more light for brighter photos at 12 megapixels. And in standard lighting conditions, pixel combine into group of four through tetra squaring process at 50 megapixel and produces some amazing pictures. Now with more point of reference, the autofocus has been improved which is certainly a good move from Samsung with improved OIS and latest lenses we should get better video quality. Moving on to the next important reason, it gets a larger vapor chamber for better heat management which will in turn result in efficiency and better power management for longer battery life. Fourth reason is this phone comes with One UI 5.1 based on Android 13 and will be eligible for four major Android upgrades and five years of security updates. This means you don't really have to upgrade your phone for the next four to five years. So until 2027, this is good enough. The last reason I would like to mention is this phone obviously gets an S Pen. So if you are someone coming from a regular S series phones or any other non Galaxy phones, then you would be amazed to see the way this S Pen works on this device. It will be handy to jot down notes, control the cameras or any other applications etc and Samsung is the only OEM who has been able to integrate a stylus into a phone so effectively. These are some of the major reasons I felt I should share it with you guys. Apart from these obviously this is a top of the line Samsung's flagship phone which offers a beautiful display on this boxy design with all the flagship specifications one can get in today's market. Now you let me know whether you are planning to buy this device or not and share your reasons as well. I'm excited to get my hands on on this device. I will get this phone in a few days. So you stay tuned to watch some useful contents on this device. That's about it. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye bye.